Tonight, this was a day of recognition for seven graduating students at Preble High School, honored for the path they are about to walk. Chris Schuler reports all are entering the military, choosing now to serve their country. Inside the library at Preble High School, young heroes sit, soon to be honored. For the decisions they've made to enter the armed forces after graduation. It's a day of real happiness for us. Because we know that our students are giving of their of themselves. For the third straight year, Preble High School held its service recognition day, setting aside time to acknowledge the sacrifice each of these students is making in the next chapter of their lives. The following seven students that we are recognizing today are answering the important call of civic action and public service. Two are entering the Air Force, five others are becoming Marines. Will Oldenburg says he's eager to join his Marine family. There have been so many U.S. service members, you know, over the years that have served, you know, that some have given their lives, and uh, I think why not me? I'd want to step into their shoes and, you know, just continue the legacy. Kaylin Miller McDonald is entering the Air Force, her father proud of the person she's become. So I'm happy for her. Grandpa was in the Air Force, kind of following the footsteps of my grandpa. It is, as they say, the ultimate, uh, ultimate sacrifice and commitment uh, to serve and to, to commit to that. Decisions that need to be recognized on Service Recognition Day here at Preble High School. Ask now what your country can do for you. Ask what you can do for your country. Reporting in Green Bay, Chris Schuller, Local 5 News. Also today at Preble, a plaque was dedicated in memory of seven Preble High School students who gave their lives in combat during the Vietnam War. The plaque to be permanently installed in the school library contains their names, branch of service, graduating class, and date of death.